My name is Kaylee Jo. I just recently graduated from Ithaca College with a degree in biochemistry. So I've worked with Mary and Erica, our two group leaders, uh, in the health center for about three years now. And every year they were talking to me about how they do this trip to Africa. And the first time they told me, I was like, I have to go. Good job. It's fun. So far what we've done is we've come down to the crisis care nursery and we've been just kind of relieving some of the nannies that work here by entertaining the children and playing with them and feeding them, changing their diapers, etc. So this little fellow right here I actually um, saw online when Dr. Ken Root was emailing me and he actually he has a medical condition um, and he's here in the nursery and I could not wait to meet him after I saw the picture. I was like, that is one of the cutest little boys I've ever seen. And I was so happy when I came down that he was still here. As a nurse practitioner, I'm hoping to go into pediatrics and work with children. So being here is like a dream for me. We are helping in um, the Ministry of Hope Medical Clinic. So I think a lot of what we're gonna be doing is helping to like um, put together the medicine. We get big tubs of medication and it has to be um, divvied up between people. So what we do is we put it into smaller baggies and stuff um, so it could easily be handed out per person. When I first got to the clinic, they put me on lab. Since I graduated with a degree in biochem, they thought it would be a really good experience for me to get to work with clinical microbiology. And so what I was able to do was to prick the children's fingers, and adults too, essentially, and um, I was drawing the blood from their fingertips. Right now, I'm blow drying the blood onto the slides to make sure that it dries before looking at it under the microscope. And what we're going to do is look to see if we see any parasites that would be positive for malaria. And it was really neat, except for I pricked and worked up 30 slides, but after eight slides, um, the microscope, the battery, the portable battery had died, so the microscope wasn't working. So that was a really really hard thing to have to see is that that's an everyday struggle here is um, that the power and stuff cuts out and it was really sad that there were that many people who weren't going to know whether or not they had malaria. My priority of coming to Africa is the medical aspect of it so um, once I finally get my degree I will be back here for sure. <laughs>